Hey, what's going on everybody? In this video, we are going to be talking about Cassie Chan, the pink Turbo Ranger. Let's get into it. Hit that intro, Rangers. You are watching the fan club. You're watching the fan club. And you're watching the fan club. Do you know what time it is? And you know what time it is. It's time for the fan club. Let's go. Hey! I can't do this on my own, because you know they Yo, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to the fan club. It is your boy, Brosdan. Brosdan in the building. Welcome, welcome to the show. The Ranger Database videos go on, and there's not many episodes left. Today, we are going to be talking about Gen 2 Turbo Pink Cassie Chan. If you've been following the videos, we talked about Cassie in the In Space season but there's more story to be told with this ranger. We're gonna tell you how she got to be a turbo power ranger. So let's get into the video. Cassie Chan, the pink turbo ranger, is a force to be reckoned with. Hailing from Stone Canyon, Cassie initially aspired to pursue her musical dreams in Angel Grove. Fate, however, had a different plan in store for her when she crossed paths with TJ and Catherine Hillard, the pink turbo ranger. Destiny called when Catherine bestowed her powers upon Cassie, recognizing her spirit and determination. As the pink turbo ranger, Cassie exhibited an ability to face danger head on, pushing her limits with courage. Her bond with the mysterious Phantom Ranger, who remained an enigma throughout her tenure, hinted at a hidden crush that added a touch of intrigue to her character. Absolutely loved Cassie Chan. When we first met her, she was listening to music. She was super cool. Almost the opposite of Cat, which was freaking awesome because when you're introducing a new character you don't want to make them the exact same personality if you do that then you're really making them stand in the last actor's shoes so they gave cassie a completely different personality and in the beginning something was going on with tommy they had to help him and she wasn't really about that life at first she was like really you trying to get involved and battle these monsters all right i'll help and she had a good heart and towards the end of it she was beating up monsters too beating up the piranatrons and it was a cool episode they ended up saving tommy's life and that was the moment when you knew that those two were going to be power rangers obviously whenever they introduce new characters into power rangers especially in those early seasons everyone's like oh is this gonna be a new character and yes we knew it was coming too because the power ranger actors even in the press for the movies were saying you know we're gonna be in the movie we're gonna do like half the season but we're gonna be doing other stuff soon which was cool because unfortunately power rangers turbo is talked about like a failure and like it's not a good season i actually appreciate the season it was just that first half was kind of mad because the characters were moving on they weren't really putting a lot of character growth and a lot of development in these characters and, and really good storytelling compared to what they did with that Gen 2 cast like Cassie and Carlos and company because they were new characters. They had to give us new stories and character development to get these characters into in space, which we all know crushed it. So yes, the season gets a lot of hate, but without Turbo, there would be no in space, which is arguably one of the best seasons of all time beyond her ranger duties cassie remained a passionate musician effortlessly embodying the rebel spirit with her grunge rocker style her guitar skills and fierce attitude made her a natural fit for her former all-girl rock band despite her tough exterior cassie possessed a compassionate heart always ready to stand up for her friends and fight for what is right her strong will and independence were evident in her pursuit of her dreams, showcasing her determination to make her mark on the world. She had more of a tomboy style, 
but she shattered all of those like societal expectations, paving her way with confidence and embracing her unique spirit. Her determination and sense of justice made her a formidable force as the pink turbo ranger leaving an unforgettable legacy. I loved this character when she went off into space. That was like some of the coolest episodes of Power Rangers for me. The end of Turbo was freaking awesome because we never saw a team of Rangers get defeated. And there is a question on my mind. Would the Turbo Rangers have been okay if Demetria and Blue Centaurian were there? If it was a different set of Rangers like Tommy and the OGs, would have they stand at a better chance? It's interesting because this was a young crew of Rangers. They only got a half season. So like a few months of being Power Rangers, then Divatox just takes down their whole base. Like how crazy was that? They were forced to go into in space and they had a new leader who was Andros. He was the leader because he understood way more what was happening, especially out in the galaxy. It wouldn't make sense to make TJ even though he is a great strategist and brings a lot to a team, make him the leader because he's going to be walking into a lot of situations with a lot of people he's never seen before. It would be difficult. It made a lot of sense to make Andros the leader, which that was just a freaking awesome season. But Turbo is a slept on season. Let's be honest here. I love you guys. What did you think of the pink turbo ranger Cassie Chan? The rest of these videos till we wrap it up are going to be the gen two rangers. So let me know your thoughts. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time rangers. Peace. I just want to give a special shout out to the gold ranger members out there. The Arctic operator, Roderick Ham, Papillon Purple, Salima Ramirez, Danny Nascimento, Steven Heffelman, Chaos Draco, Thomas Franco, Anime King Nick, Lewis Cairns, Miguel Ortiz, and Sean Schiffer. Thank you guys so much for your support. And if you want a video shout out like this one, sign up to be a Gold Ranger member today. I just want to shout out all of the fans out there for taking the time out of their day to watch this content. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you can, please like, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and hit that share button. And if you guys want to be a member, click that join button right now. We have a Blue Ranger membership that gets you into the exclusive fan chat discord then we have the gold ranger membership it gets you into the fan chat but you also get a video shout out at the end of every video i want to thank you guys again if you can sign up to be a member we will see you next time peace hi hi we're bulk and Let's skull go. We, we have been, been requested, requested by, by the, the Fun Club, Club to say something funny. <laughs>